Nino's a New York guy. Uh, he's, uh, he's best childhood friend of Bernie Rose. It's played by Albert Brooks in the film. Um, sort of middle-level gangster, um, but not Italian. A Jewish guy who uh, kind of is an Italian wannabe. Uh, he's good at what he does. He, he's pretty rough around the edges. He, uh, but he earns money, so he's effective. And uh, he's of use to the boys back east, who are the guys that originally funded him and got him going in uh, whatever rackets he chose to uh, participate in. Um, and, uh, you know, he's involved in so many things that he's bound to take a part in this little tale of ours. Well, they, they, they all kind of uh, moonlight doing various things. Driver is uh, essentially a stunt driver, but um, sort of uh, pads his resume, pads his bank account by uh, um, getting involved in more nefarious things. So he and Nino kind of are bound to run into each other, but in an amazingly coincidental, coincidental series of mishappenstances. And um, um, it turns out that, uh, that this particular um, caper is real bad for everybody. Uh, it's uh, really, really badly played by, uh, particularly by Nino and anyone Nino is associated with. So it, it leads to the unraveling of um, a lot of people's uh, hopes and dreams. I hope audiences get to see it. That's what I hope most of all. Um, it's uh, uh, so strange now the way movies, uh, you know, are making their way or not making their way into the marketplace. That I really hope this is a, this is not a mainstream film. This is kind of like a um, something else, something very unique, very. Um, studied, and um, it's not. It's certainly not going to be for everybody, and it's never going to be marketed like it's a big tentpole event. So, I'm just hoping that um, it sees the light of day, that it gets the audience that is, you know that would appreciate something where this much thought and care goes into, and um, that's it.